Hello, I'm Christina from the US. I think there are some that, that are quite easier than others. I know the UK accent I can distinguish pretty well. Also, the Irish accent, Australian accent. I struggle a little bit with like New Zealand. Scottish, maybe I can distinguish. So I would say like those few I'm pretty good at. Blindfolds are always so like awkward because I can't see anything. <laughs> it's so weird not being able to see anyone. <laughs> Hi, my name is Sophie. I'm a librarian. My soul food is <coughs> chicken pie and my hobby is photography. Nice to meet you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think I know where she's from. What do you like to do on the weekends? So on the weekend, I like to go to the beach and hang out with my friends. <laughs> I'm hearing a mixed accent. First it sounded from the UK and now it's sounding kind of Australian in a way. Go to the beach. It's like, it sounds a little like Australian, but the voice is a little familiar. So, <laughs> let's see, what other questions should I ask? What's your favorite food dish? As I mentioned before, my soul, soul food is meat pie, particularly chicken pie, maybe chicken and leek pie. Can I give my final answer? I would say the UK, particularly. That part sounded very UK. Mm. Okay. Hi. I, I knew it was her. <laughs> I knew you would know it was me. I tried so hard. Oh my I gosh. tried so hard, Christina. You were like, you were doing like. When I said hi first, I went American and I was like, wait, no, I'm supposed to be Australian. Yeah, you switched it up a little like, bit. Hi. <laughs> I like didn't want to be like, hi, Lauren, but. <laughs> But it, you sounded different. Your accent was changing. It was throwing me off. I was but trying so hard. I know my friend. I'm a librarian I know my now. friend's voice. <laughs> yeah, it's hard. It's hard. It's, uh, she's even heard my Australian oh, attempt yeah. at an Australian accent before. Yeah. Oh, nice, nice try. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what was the name you said? Sophie. Sophie. <laughs> Sophie. It's quite like, oh, actually one of my best friends is called Sophie. It's kind of like a cool name to say in an Australian accent, it's like Sophie. Yeah. So cool. So you went from US to like... We've got Claire and now we have oh, yeah. Sophie. Claire. So Sophie is your Australian, Australian persona. persona. <laughs> cool. All right. I was you like, did great. I was like, you're gonna even smell my perfume and it's me. So <laughs> no, I was probably. like, please don't smell. <laughs> okay, bye. See you. Good luck. <laughs> Hi, my name is Rhea. I'm a teacher here. Um, my soul food is pap and bors. My hobbies are playing the piano and um, acting, and it's nice to meet you. A little tricky. <laughs> um, very, very like slight, slight, tiny accent. But I'm trying to think of where. This is a little difficult. <laughs> What's your favorite type of music? What do you like to listen to? I actually love listening to contemporary Christian music. Mm. Mm. Okay, so the word contemporary, I would say contemporary, but it was a little bit different. Contemporary. 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 It's a little different than like how I would say it. I don't think it's like UK, not, not Ireland, not... U.S. not Canada. Ooh. Okay, right now I'm thinking either because these are the two countries that's like a little bit hard for me to distinguish is either New Zealand or South Africa. Those are the two that I'm kind of debating on right now. But it's kind of hard for me because I don't hear that accent often. So those are the two that it's kind of hard for me to distinguish. So I'm like 50-50 right now on those two countries. What do you like to do on the weekend? I prefer staying indoors and reading, watching movies. That's what I love doing. 
I feel like New Zealand accent is a little bit stronger. And then also they they usually say like the R's are like ah, but ah, like that, kind of like that. But I'm not hearing that. So I'm leaning towards South Africa. Oh, that's bright. Oh, <laughs> hi. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're so good at this. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh! It's actually one of the hardest to listen to, um, to distinguish. It's a little oh, bit really? hard. Yeah, because um, I think I have like two South African friends, so it sounded a little bit similar, but the accent to me isn't very like strong, unless you're from a certain area, right? Yeah, cool. Where, where in South Africa are you from? I am from a place called Rustenburg in the <gasps> Northwest province, which is like three hours away from Johannesburg, which is oh, like the nice. capital, known as the capital. For yeah, that. right. Which, yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah, my friends are from Cape Town. Ah. So I've seen like a lot of pictures. It looks like a beautiful wow. place. So mm -hmm, I really want to visit there sometime. Yeah. Oh, cool. Okay. <laughs> Hi, my name is Mia and I'm an actor and voice actor. My soul food is Pasta. My hobby is going for walks, shopping. <laughs> nice to meet you. Mm. You do sound like a voice actress. You <laughs> have a very nice voice, first Thank of you. all. <laughs> oh, this one's pretty hard because I'm also like trying to hear the R's because that kind of gives it away sometimes if she really pronounces the R or not. It might also be tripping you out with my oh. accent. Oh no, <laughs> don't mess with me. Cause like to me it sounds like from the US maybe, but at least not from the Northeast because we like to just say like, we don't like to say our R's and I'm hearing the R's, which is kind of like, hmm. Again, I might be tripping you out. Right, you might be. <laughs> What country do you want to travel to? I really want to go to Canada. Okay, <laughs> wait a second. Wait a second, I heard a little something in there. I really want to go. Mm. <laughs> it was a little rounded out. That sounded Australian. Mm. Uh, I would say that that accent, like the, it's like the rounded out go, like sounds Australian to me. Okay, maybe I'll ask one more question. Mm -hmm. What are your hobbies? Going for walks, shopping, watching movies, TV shows, things like that. Australian. <laughs> shows. <laughs> 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 it, it's, it sounds Australian to me. Just the way it's like the uh, vowels are sounding. You're throwing me a little off because I would expect like the, the R's to be like ah. Mm -hmm. You know, but I'm not hearing that, but it's the vowel sounds that you're making. It's a little rounded out Australian accent. Mm. So, <laughs> no, no, sorry, sorry. so I think my final answer would be Australian. Yeah, I am from Australia. Oh, wait, <laughs> like it's kind of throwing me off a bit because it's almost yeah. like a mix of I was kind of tripping you out in the beginning to try and like uh, fake an American accent, but yeah, but I'm okay. from Australia. Yeah, I could, yeah, I could hear it a bit, but it wasn't as strong as mm. other Australian uh, their accents. Right. So I was yeah, I've heard that. Throw me strong. off a bit, but, but yeah, okay. good job. Thank you. Yeah, oh, it's wow. the R's that really nice. get people. It is. Yeah. 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 It was a little difficult. It was a little challenging. I think especially the South African accent, I haven't heard it a lot. So it's a little bit difficult. So I think that was the hardest. So that one was pretty much like process of elimination. Yeah, for the Australian accent, at first it was a little bit difficult, but then once I heard kind of like the vowel sounds, it became easier. Um, I think I did get a good amount of practice just being on World Friends. So I think I had like a little bit of an advantage. Yeah, I was glad I could guess all of them correctly. <laughs> So today I tried to guess the nationality from different accents. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And see you next time. Bye.